One, two, buckle my shoe. What are we doing? Uh, we're talking about our relationship. One fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. No. I'm Arielle Jessup. I'm the co-creator of Loners. I'm also playing Dakota. Okay, um, my name is Olivia Holcomb, and I play the character Jess. Um, <laughs> I'm Dan. I play Jared. I am Benjamin Sidney. I play Pete. My name is Melissa Demetris, and I am the writer-director of Loners, the series. Let's take a look at it. What are we gonna do with them? They have no plan. They just need more time. They're 30 years old and living in our house, Paul. What, what do you want me to do, put them out on the street? The dream I was having, I'm glad it was fake. My mother was right, I have to relax. These thoughts I am having are holding me back. It may sound depressing, yeah, I know it's so sad. I am so sick of living in this head. I have no job, I have no money, and I have no backup. I went across the entire fucking country to find myself, and now I'm here, living with your parents. More lost than ever. What happened to us? You, I, fuck this! Jess! Jess! No, I am not getting attached to you or anyone else in this stupid hick town. <gasps> At your dad's party. <laughs> You're a bad influence on me. <laughs> you never think you can handle life until it happens, and you just do. And sometimes you have exactly what you need, exactly when you need it. And sometimes that comes in the form of another person right beside you, helping to carry the load. Follow your dreams, they said. Oh my god, I have to get back to New York. I have to get back to my life. <laughs> Would you like to sleep in my tent? <laughs> Oh, please, can I sleep in your tent? <laughs> Without you. Loners is about two best friends who, for very different reasons, move back to their hometown. And it's about their separate journeys and their journey together and their friendship. You fall in love with these women and their friendship because it's so authentic and they start to really get it and then something happens and it's like, oh! <laughs> he is the uh, main love interest of Dakota in season one. They immediately form a toxic relationship where uh, Jared just... But like a hot one. Right, right. <laughs> I'm Jared, I'm the worst. I've held a candle for um, Jess for quite a long time. He kind of opens up little doors inside my heart that I want to, that I want shut. I don't want them to be open. These are independent characters who are sort of finding a way at 30 years old to come into their truest selves and being pushed into a situation, living in their hometown, facing all of the shit that they never thought they'd have to face. They're becoming versions of themselves that are more raw and more authentic and these characters still have access to everything that the Manic Pixie Dream Girl has access to. Jess and Dakota share that like balancing energy of like they're really able to bounce off each other and be extremely resilient. And what's really important to me is that when people see this show, they can say, that's me, that's been me, I've been there, and can see themselves in these characters. And there's sort of a new generation of TV realism that's happening right now with Jill Soloway and Mark and Jay Duplass with Togetherness of characters that are just in their lives and we enter their lives and we live it with them for a little while and then we come out when the season's over. Action! That's what the series is! <laughs> we love you guys. We're so happy that you took the time to watch our video. 
and we really want to collaborate with all the other young artists out there, not so young artists out there, and have you be a part of a project that means so much to us and so much to all the people in this room that you can't even see. If you can share this on Facebook, share this on Twitter, share this with your friends, share this with anyone who you think would be interested, crowdfunding is the best way to make this a collaborative effort and that's what we really want to do. Oh, because we're poor. <laughs> <laughs> Ask the question again and edit that out. <laughs>